When you look back at your time at Universal, uh, obviously there's The Creature, there's uh, Bend of the River with Jimmy Stewart. Are there any, any favorite films when you look back at that, at that length of time when you were under contract and any special memories that, that you'd like to share? Well, yeah. it's, uh, I really love to work, so I had a, a very good time on all of them. I mean, right. that was really, and uh, even Creature from the Black Lagoon, you know, people kind of laugh about that, but mm. uh, I had a wonderful time on that picture, really. Sure. Uh-huh, uh, and, and Jack Arnold was such a good director, mm -hmm. and so on, and, uh, and then the people I got to work with, as mm -hmm. we've just talked about some of them. Right. So that was, it was really, uh, I, I, I feel badly for some young actresses today, because I don't think that system is there anymore. No, it's, it's long gone. Yes. It's long gone. What did you feel like when, what happened? Did Universal like not renew your contract and they started shedding their contract players as the studio system came to an end and you were it one of those? What did it feel like to have that protective umbrella of the studio pulled away and then, That's hey, right. you're on your own and you have an agent and That's the phone right. needs That's to right. ring? How did, how did that, how did you adjust well, to that? Well, it was, it was hard to lose my home base, you sure. know, so to speak. Sure. But uh, then a lot of interesting things were happening in television. Right. So it then it, that became very interesting too because then you would go from one episode on one series to another episode on something else so you had a great variety and then you were not working long periods of time perhaps on a half hour mm -hmm. show for instance right but and then there was live television too and now you've you've written the book <laughs> uh, you are uh, seemingly every convention uh, horror convention and fantasy convention. You are there. Uh, you've you been make to, me tired to hear you, about you, it. <laughs> well, I, that's where I'm going with this because <laughs> you you have been. I think you and I have done uh, multiple screenings at the American Cinematheque. I had you out to my festival in Palm Springs, the Arthur Lyons right, Festival, right. the other year. And you're keeping a schedule that seems to outstrip the <laughs> early morning calls uh, 58 years ago at Universal. What's next and how do you keep doing it? Well, the nice thing about show business is you never really know exactly. Right. Certain things may happen and certain mm -hmm. things may not. Mm -hmm. And uh, so I think we just kind of keep the, the door open and see what happens. Mm -hmm. And if things don't happen, I have a lot of other fun things I can do too, like stay home and put my feet up, you know, mm -hmm. so. <laughs> mm -hmm. I think if I had to, I, I think if I had to give you a motto, Julie, I would say, Julie Adams, smile, life is good. Oh, oh. Thank you so much. Well, thank you so much for having me. Uh -huh.